like 2022. I'm not sure how well the audio is coming out. I'll call it because I'm like, I'm like, wow, so bad. We're about from Fort Myers, Florida. Oh my goodness. We are in the mid to upper 70s, so it's a gorgeous day here today. We are definitely battling the wind. Delta Flight 1576, A320 heading to Atlanta. Silent film. <laughs> they just said last time the wind was at 28, gusting to 36. We've had some 40 plus mile an hour gusts today, so wind shear today. A couple go arounds. I was at the garage, realized there's no way I'd ever be able to stabilize the camera up there. It's too windy for the tripod, too. And so, no chance of using a tripod today either. So. We're gonna do the best we can to handle uh, this today. Jet inbound from West Palm Beach. I'm sure this wind is related to the line of severe thunderstorms that went through uh, the south and the Midwest yesterday, produced some very violent tornadoes in Texas, Arkansas. So hopefully, everyone's okay down there. Seeing a lot of uh, damage. I'm sure that's what this uh, what this system is that's coming through. We're just expecting wind, but. United 1704 inbound from Chicago. Frontier 1042 inbound from Orlando. A couple T6 Texans that flew up. Decided to do the touch and go over at Akron Canton. Nice thing came up here. No football charter this weekend with the Browns off. Um, so after this, we're going to head over to Dayton. We're going to go to the Bomber and Brew event. So probably make a video of that depending on how much longer the wife will be at work. And then tomorrow, hopefully, we'll go to Columbus. I'm uh, still expecting possible uh, heavy jet to bring the Blue Jackets back from Finland. So I uh, don't have confirmation yet on what it'll be or what time, but hoping to get to Columbus for that. So stay tuned. 4793 inbound from LaGuardia. This is definitely the type of weather that blows all the leaves off the trees. Uh, but it is amazing that it's November and I'm up here in shorts and a t-shirt. No complaints. Oh, it is a bit windy today. Pilots are doing a great job and hopefully the flight attendants don't have to clean up 
too much bodily fluid this afternoon. It's 405. It's a max 8 inbound for this one. Gus has dropped a little bit down to 3 2. The connection 3705 inbound from Minneapolis St. Paul. Southwest just took off. I'm not really sure which one to fill. Man, he looked sideways when he got off the ground. Everything was on 24 left. Now everything's on 24 right. Now we have both runways. Salos 2739, I believe they said it was a flight number. It's a 737 800 heading to Phoenix, Arizona. Sky Harbor International Airport. If I'm a little shaky, I apologize. I'm doing the best I can to brace myself. Alert that a uh, Atlas Air 747 is diverting uh, from Chicago to Cincinnati. I wish they were coming here, of course, but it shows you how windy things are in Chicago right now. If a cargo 747 is going to divert, fingers crossed, maybe something comes in here. But they're getting like 60 mile an hour gusts out there. That's 3131 inbound from Las Vegas. Thirty-one 
160 inbound from Miami. A special livery inbound here pretty soon. Looking forward to bringing that one to you. Wind has died down a little bit. We're down to 31 knots on the gust. At least it's a little bit more manageable now. That is 512 heading to Orlando. I was all cocky a minute ago, like, yeah, the wind's died down a little bit. As soon as I say that, and I decide to film a departure. The wind picks up again. Special livery inbound, Alaska 216 inbound from Seattle. It's the more to love girls we're gonna head on out because we are gonna be heading to Dayton here in a little bit for the uh, brew and bombers event down there hoping to go down there and get some close-ups of the uh, Memphis Bell um, as long as the wife gets off here pretty soon because it's a couple hour drive so we'll probably make a video of that so looking forward to bringing that to you tomorrow we'll either be here or in Columbus uh, depending on if that uh, Columbus Blue Jackets charter comes in and depending on what time they come in and what they fly in on. But we're going to get them out of here because it's just the wind and the quality and all that is probably getting beat up a little bit. So I uh, hope you enjoyed the video. hope you enjoyed the special livery. If you liked the video, hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button down below. Um, comment down below. It helps out a ton with the algorithm. So I really appreciate everyone's support. If you're new, welcome. Uh, we try, try to post usually about three or four times a week, depending on what is going on. But uh, we'll be back up here again over the next couple of days to do some more plane spotting from Cleveland Hopkins International Airport. Have a good night, everybody.